Let's watch some crazy stuff, yo. I dare this motherfucker to take a shit in the middle of the road. I almost killed my brother. <laughs> Wait, hey, yo, what? I got two of my toes cut off by a lawnmower when I was eight years old. She's sucking the dog dick. She was sucking what? The dog dick and then she manned over the dog oh, all in there. Whoa, what are you talking whoa. about? What are you talking about, Paul? What's going on? I mean, Relax, Morty. Don't, don't worry about it. Let's just, just see where this goes. When I was eight years old, I had sexual intercourse with my dog. Jeez, Rick, oh my god. That's some pretty hardcore stuff. What in the hell? Yo, guys, tonight is story time. We're gonna ask people what's the craziest story they've ever heard or something crazy that has happened to them. Before we do that, guys, I'm giving away $50 every single video. Before I had it to every week, but I can't hit every week because sometimes it rains, sometimes my cameraman cancels on me, or, you know, shit happens, you know? So $50, easy money, leave a comment, like the video, and you have to be subscribed and follow me on Instagram. Make sure you're doing all of that to get the $50. What's your name? Mikey. Haley. Liv. Tracy BTK. Okay, BTK Vigils. Riley. Paola. Nitsa. Nicole. Nate. Jen. David. Cheyenne. Betty. Bree. Alasia. Kiara. Indy. Anaya. Monet. Chloe. Hannah. Shelby. Ryan. Cam. Gabriella. Jordan. Chris. Dazino. Ashad TV. Rico. Destiny. Stacy. Julie. You baby out two times. Mr. Sparrow. Mistress, what is that? Like a OnlyFans or something? Yes. <laughs> Figured. I'm from straight from Texas. We got this shit. Ask me the question, brother. All right, so tonight we're just asking people, what's the craziest thing that has ever happened to you? All right, we were about in seventh grade, right? Me and my friends, small town Texas, graduating class, 30 people, bro. Nobody around. Me and my buddy snuck out. You gotta keep in mind that we were about in sixth grade around there. We were young, right? I dared this motherfucker to take a shit in the middle of the road, right? This motherfucker dropped his drawers, start shitting, and then we hear a door shut behind us, and then. What's next? Fucking lights. Cop lights. They start chasing us. So we fucking run, dude. He jumps in a fucking river thing, cuts his knee, and we run home, bro. He cut his knee? Cut his knee, bro. Was it like, did he have to it get was, surgery? Was, or like, no, bro, uh, no stitches. surgery. Butterfly stitches. Butterfly stitches. Butterfly stitches. Butterfly stitches. Uh, all, right. all right, so listen, bro. Hold on. <laughs> What's the craziest thing that's ever happened to you in your life? Or maybe a story that you've heard somebody tell you? Camper hugged my ex in her dad's camper. Dad's camper. And his room was right across. It wasn't even a room. It was like in the camper, in the kitchen. Her dad's door was wide open while I was cracking at her. I swear to God. I swear, on everything I love. You think he low key heard, heard that? or? Well, of course he fucking heard that. And then I fucking took that to the bathroom. Hey Mitchell, you're being a fucking perv, dude. Don't look. <laughs> We locked eyes and then he finished. That means his load is on your soul for eternity. Holy shit. You think he's lying, bro? Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. I know he bullshitting. Don't Dude, listen. That's Gio. And <laughs> that's Gio. That's Gio, and that's the biggest capper in CT. And I ain't gonna lie. I'm BTK Visuals, and I could I could buy out his fucking Audi, his pizza shop, whatever he wants me to do. This my this my this my son right here. <laughs> whoa, whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Pause, pause. He started smiling. He liked it, you <laughs> fruity fuck. Pause, pause. That's weird shit. Bro, he, get, he gets no business, bro. Listen. All right. All right. What's up, ladies? What the fuck? All right, ladies. What's the craziest story you've ever, like, had? Like, That's the... such, like, a broad topic. Yeah, but, like, you, you, something has happened in your life that you could talk about. Like, something crazy. Crazy. Get the thing. fuck out of here. Who Yo, knows? Mikey, who are you talking oh, to? No, 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 you're fucking no, out. No, 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 you want me to expose right now? Do you want me to expose? Yo, where the no, boat? Where the boat? Where the boat? She's wild. Cause what the <laughs> She know my spies. No, no, no. <laughs> All right, so listen. What's the craziest thing? It could be like a near-death experience. It could be like... I got chased by a fox one time. When I snuck out of my house, I got chased by a fox and almost got attacked by a fox. But I survived. I broke somebody's fence and I hit my head on a tree and woke all the birds up in the tree, but it was fine. I almost killed my brother. <laughs> Wait, hey, yo, what? <laughs> when I was little, I like pushed him off my boat. Like I had a boat, okay? Wait, like a, a boat? A I had a boat, I'm okay, I had a boat. But you can't like and buy I a boat. I pushed my brother off the boat when I was three years old or some shit. I don't know how old wait, I was. And she'd do it again. And I'd do it again. Wait, no, I'm kidding. I love my brother. Hey, wait, if you, were you on the lake or like? <laughs> yes, I was in the fucking ocean. I don't know where in I was. In the ocean or the lake? Uh, oh, I don't know. The 
the ocean is pretty. Years old, bro. Like, he could have got Anyways, hit by a shark. I kill. I almost killed him, and my dad had to come jump in and save him. But I, I almost killed him. And how'd you feel about that? Did you feel bad or was it funny to you? I, I, I don't know, but I feel bad now because if my brother died, I would be really upset. Yeah, that's you know that would be. I mean? He's the only boy out of me and my sisters, so okay. you know what I mean. I feel bad. So you treasure him? Yes, I love him. Yes. Older but brother, I, younger brother? The older brother. Okay. So if I killed him, that'd be really depressing. Facts. Yeah. <laughs> uh, come here, bro. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. Right? It was me and Shorty one time, and we was fucked up. Wait, Mikey, come here real quick. Come here. Come here. Bro. Yo, so I ain't gonna lie. There's some crazy shit. I was with this bitch, and we were mad drunk, and I won't lie, but I fucked her with a zucchini. I put a zucchini in. Her pussy. I put a zucchini in her pussy and I fucked her with it. I swear to God. A raw zucchini. I'm you dead put, ass. You put a zucchini inside in a, her, her yes, cooch. Yes, I fucked her with a zucchini. I'm so dead ass. <laughs> like, anything I, yo, bro, stop checking my, yo. Crazy, yo, hold on. But I swear to God, bro, it was just like in a moment. We was there, right? And I don't even know what went through my mind, bro, but I somehow I grabbed the zucchini. Where did the zucchini come from? Like, my, I have a garden. <laughs> I got a garden, Hello. swear to God. I started fucking her with a zucchini, and I'm Wait, not lying. And like, in the garden? You were in the garden? No, 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 no. Or you bro, went into I, the garden? I have them in my house. Oh, like, okay. I pick them from my garden, I bring them inside. And we was just fucked up, bro. I don't know what got into me, bro, but I swear to God. I grabbed a zucchini and I started fucking her with a zucchini. Where, where did everything I love? Was she enjoying it or what? Yes. Yeah, she didn't even know it was. She didn't even know it was a zucchini. I swear to God. No That's crazy. Yo, Growing up. He get no ass. And he lying. He Yo. a fat nosed bitch. He don't get no dope either. Yo, what's the craziest story you have for me? The craziest story. You got beat with a metal chair. <laughs> <laughs> At Atlanta's Pizza on this block right here. <laughs> to this day. Is that facts? Yeah. Chill, chill, chill. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, hey, no. Hey, hey, listen, listen, listen. For real though, though, what's the craziest story? The craziest story? Uh, I caught my ex at the bar with her ex. Fuck it. And, and did you confront? It. Yeah, I confront and still got poked. What's the craziest story or the craziest thing that has ever happened to you? Happened to me or happened to my head? Take it for example, I told you how I put a zucchini in a bitch's pussy. Okay, the TMI. All right, back. Out of here. So, <laughs> nah, craziest shit that happened to me out here. I was in Bar New Haven, feel me? I, was, I came outside, niggas, uh, niggas don't want to go ahead and have beef with me and shit because I took somebody shorty and shit. It's all right, fuck it. I ain't even worried about it. I saw a nigga hit me that like, yo, sucker punch me and dead in the face, my nigga. Once I got sucker punch. When I was when I was eight years old, I had sexual intercourse with my dog. What? What? Bruh. That be my story. I'm gonna tell you right now, all I did was fight some motherfuckers and my niggas joined in. That nigga fucked his dog. That beat me, yo, 100%, bro. That nigga fucked his dog. 100%. I ain't lying. What's the craziest thing that has ever happened to you? Respectfully? Craziest thing that ever happened to me? I had this one tree sit on my face, bro. This bitch coochie was dirty as hell. That shit smell OD. What it smell like? Look at, look at Unk trying to get lit. Look at Unk trying to get lit. Look, look, look. look. Unk, get lit! Hey, Unk, get over here! Unk, Unk, get lit! Unk, 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 Oh yeah, huh? Kevin, Kevin yeah. Jones. Oh, I'm I'm love. Love. Kevin Allen I'm Jones. I'm love. Jones. Yeah. He said, he said but, Kevin Allen yeah. Jones, man, but I ain't said? drinking today. Oh. I, 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 I Who we smoking on? We smoking on a Yo, I nah, I don't know what the hell you smoking on. I'm smoking on something different. Yo, what's the craziest thing that ever happened to you? The craziest thing, yo, I was on the back porch on Kissing Street, on the back porch on the third floor selling drugs, and the dog fucking Daryl in the ass. Oh, yeah. How about, that's crazy oh, shit, how about that? The dog did what? Yo, he had that red thing come out, it came out really pointy. She sucking the dog dick. She was sucking what? The dog dick, and then she man over the dog oh, all in there. Whoa, what are you talking whoa. about? What are you talking about, whoa. Paul? Yo, I'm tweaking, bro. <laughs> are you uh, dominatrix or something? Yes. Really? Yes. Okay, so what's the craziest thing you've ever done? I've shot in someone's mouth before. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yo. Wait, hold on, hold on. Backtrack, backtrack. First off. No, but you know, that's the craziest thing that, you know, shit happens. Okay, how much did he pay you for that? $5,000. Bruh. Yo, five grand? Yo, guys, if you want her to shit in your mouth, she got you. No, that all depends. Okay, it depends. It depends. It's situational. I like you or not. So you really like this guy then? Like, did you have to, like, work your way to that? Yes. Like, what were the initial, like, uh, like the beginning Creating a relationship, uh... Did you go on dates with him? a repertoire and all that. Yes, of course. Okay, like, how many dates did you go on before? I would say, like, five dates. Five dates? Yeah. And where did he take you? Out here, New Haven. Okay, so did he, like, do anything extravagant? 
it for you? Were there any times where he like did other things other than just the five grand for shitting in his well, mouth? Well, yeah. I mean, I got Louboutins, I got Issa and Ram, I got purses, I got everything that I fucking wanted. Damn. All right. <laughs> all right. And how, how do you how do you like doing OnlyFans? Do you, oh is it fulfilling God, for I you or? I fucking love it. I love it. You like being in control? Oh my God. <laughs> yes. If I could choke you right now, I would. Yeah, I give you permission right now. Choke me. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that was crazy. Yeah, that kind of turned me on. I ain't gonna lie. All right, I'm not. I'm, not, I'm joking. <laughs> it, it's it's too tiny it. anyway. You wouldn't feel it. All right, interesting. Well, guys, I'm vouching. That was great. So hit up her OnlyFans. Mr. Severa. There you guys have it. All right, check her out. <laughs> I just got a restraining order on my ex-boyfriend, oh and we just saw him. And we just saw him. <laughs> he left in the club. Hello. Yeah. The restraining or order only applies if, if he's like intentionally trying to be around yeah, you, right? Yeah, I was gonna tell him, he don't worry, I'm not gonna snitch, he's not he gonna leave. To leave. But I'm gonna tell you something though, he crazy, so if y'all... Why is he crazy though? He was yelling just because I said I had to focus on school. Yeah, he's insane. Just because I had to focus on school. <laughs> so he was just toxic and abusive? Yeah, because he loved his ass though, hey! I got two of my toes cut off by a lawnmower when I was eight years old. What? I've seen your toes. Wait. You have both toes. So you're missing two toes? On my right leg. You've seen them. She's Are seen them. I've been her roommate for two years. She knows. She knows. Well, like, did it hurt? Do you remember? No, I went into, like, shock immediately. So, like, I didn't feel anything. And then, like, your parents took you to the hospital? Oh, yeah. My dad freaked out. Did they put it back on? No. They're they, still missing. They couldn't save it? No. They, oh, got it, they got amputated. What was left of them got amputated. I think that's cat. No, it's, it's not cat. She only got eight toes. I was eight years old when this happened. Oh, I remember. That's I remember my roommate. That. She knows. She do. She do got only eight toes. That's crazy. <laughs> I remember I was like, I seen this bitch with a weird toe and it was her. One time I got invited to a party and it was like a bunch of furries. And like, you know, it was like one of them like, you know like, what's that thing called where it's like a party? What's that called? What what is it called? Or like an orgy or something? Yeah, it was like, yeah, it was like an orgy. It was like an orgy? Oh, a swinger yeah. party. Like a swinger, and I was like, like a... yeah, it was a swinger party. That's what I was looking for. That's what I was looking for. I was looking for a swinger party. A swinger and it was furry a party. Swinger furry party. And they said, what animal would you like to be? And I said, deer. He want a And they gave me a deer, a deer uh, yeah. costume. What was your Wait, look at his outfit though. Yeah, let's look at it. Let's look at it. Hey. Oh, hey. So where this bro, from? Where this from, bro? It's from uh, Godspeed. Hey, hey, and what about the jeans, Brody? Uh, I don't know. And what about the sneakers, bro? I don't even know. They got them. They shipped them to me. Okay. Hey, 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 tu eres boricua. Puñeta. Hey, you are people. What's the craziest thing that has ever happened to you? Um, I ain't gonna lie. I was fucking some bitch, right? Oh. And I was tying her up with um iPhone wires. What? Oh. So that shit is mad loose. Like, nah, that shit didn't break? Sure, no, nah, no, nah, I made sure to tie it up tight. I was using HDMI cord. HDMI <laughs> cord. An HDMI cord and the iPhone wire. And I was using the wide headphones to tie her legs up in missionary. And I was killing her shit. You look like a little ass boy. I'm not gonna hold you. Don't don't make up lies, Bobby. Because you got the You wanna see on videos? <laughs> <laughs> he got an OnlyFans. Oh, I, my bad. He got OnlyFans. I got videos. <laughs> He about to pull up the videos. He, show he videos. got the, oh, he no, got the no, receipts. No, no, close that. I'm trying to see the video. You want to see the video? No. no. I want to see the video. I got yes. You want to see the video? No. For real? No, 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 no. No. Child no. Porn. I got gotcha. you. Child. I got the video. I got the video. Don't worry. Child porn. Don't worry, I got the video. Is no it my favorite? No, chill, chill, chill. I don't, I'm, for the content, we might have to see the video. All right, hey, hey, hey. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, shit. You got, you got the video. <laughs> What's the craziest thing that has ever happened to you? Uh, craziest story was probably a story my friends told me about when I was blackout drunk. And I ended up dunking my head into a pool and then a hot tub and then going back and forth for about an hour because I was too hot and too cold. <laughs> you were like confusing yourself with the uh, temperatures? Honestly, I have no idea. That's what I was told. You were just blacked out drunk. You, you literally don't that recall That was the one anything. and only time in my life I've been blackout drunk. Damn. And when, this was recently or what? Uh, uh, about two years ago. Okay. Tell them Oh my god. Oh, no, no. We call this girl Double Western. Me and my boy Nate. I'm, my name's Nate. My other boy's name Nate, too, right? We're at my girl Alexis' house, right? And we're chilling there. It's me and Pussy. Nate. Pussy. Chill with that. Chill with that. Chill with that. Yo, fuck. <laughs> what the fuck is that? Anyways, we're chilling at this girl's house, right? And we're both. It's me and my boy Nate. We're laying on the ground under the blanket. Back the fuck up, Jake. On God. Get off my shoulder. I'll beat the shit out of you. We're chilling at this blanket at my girl's house. We're watching a movie. It's like two of us in front of like this ottoman so nobody can see us. 
and there's this girl named Ava. She lays in between us. Wait, we, hold on. You and your boy were laying down next Me to and my boy Nate. Yeah. We're watching a movie together? Yeah. Where? Listen, uh, Where? listen, listen. Okay, listen. I'll, I'll just make sure I'm understanding the story. Listen, listen, listen. Uh. There's like maybe like eight people behind us. We're laying uh, in front uh, of this ottoman. Gotcha, boys gotcha. and girls, boys and girls. Bad, bad, bad. Group, 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 group. Yeah, yeah, group, group, group. Anyways, this girl lays in between us under this blanket. She starts feeling up on me, rubbing on my thigh and shit. She grabs on my dick. Give me the Western grip. You know what the Western grip is? Yo, imagine you're grabbing a pistol out of your pocket. <laughs> I'm talking Western grip. She give me one of these outside the pants, outside the pants change up. Next day, I'm on Xbox with my boy Nate. Right the one right next to me on the other side, other side of Ava. It's, it's me, Ava, Nate. Nate, Ava, Nate. Weird as fuck. Anyways, he's on the other side of me. He's like, yo, I'm not gonna lie. Ava was giving me a hand job under the blanket when you were right next to me. And I'm like, are you fucking serious? She was doing the same thing. Over the pants, double hand job, same time. Call it double Western. <laughs> double Western. Double, Double Western. Western. Crazy, crazy, <laughs> crazy. What's the craziest thing that has ever happened to you? The craziest thing? Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh. Yeah. Once I give someone a shot, that's something Somebody got shot at my apartment building like not, not too long ago. Actually. Somebody got shot? Yeah, that's crazy, yeah. I thought I thought a cat was stuck in the tree because I saw mad cows and like the ambulance. I was like, we're in America. <laughs> What's the craziest thing that has ever happened to you? I've been stabbed before. You got stabbed? Yeah. All right, so like, were you fighting somebody? Yeah. I was fighting somebody and I didn't have a weapon, but she did. And she stabbed me through my hand and then she pulled it out. I have a scar in the back of my hand. You have to get stitches or what? Like, yeah, I had to get like nine stitches. That's it? Yeah, that's it. And it just healed? It was and like it. a butcher knife, so it wasn't really nothing. Yeah, but it went through you. I was still punching her. You had that adrenaline. Yeah. That shit kicked in. Yeah. So like, what were you fighting about though? Like, what was the reason? Because you know, bitches like to talk shit. You know, I mean, at the time, she was just a, a fucking slut. Like, she, she just fucked a bunch of people I knew. She was weird. She was talking shit. So I just decided to fight her, and she decided to bring a weapon because she's pussy. Word. That. To be honest, um, it was my friend. Like, my I was friends with her for like years, and she pulled out a knife on me. Um, she didn't actually stab me, but she just pulled out a knife on me. But the craziest thing is, I'm still friends with her. You gotta be careful with that one. Yeah, I know. That's okay. wicked. You still trust her? Yeah, no. Nah, I don't. I don't. I don't be going. Her house at all, but like I still talk to her type shit. So she's not really your best friend anymore. Not really, not really. Oh, my ex tried to kill me. Like literally kill you? Like shot a gun. At me. Oh my god. Wait, but you didn't get shot though. No, cause he can't aim. <laughs> <laughs> That, that's a good thing. I, Definitely a good thing, but it was real close, really. Real close. So why did he try to shoot you? He said he don't remember, he don't know, so I don't know. For real, I was asleep. I was sleeping you in the bed. You were sleeping? I was sleeping in the bed. I was sick as fuck. So you guys had a fight before that? No, I was sleeping in the bed. So you did it by accident? No, he no. didn't. How do you shoot somebody that's sleeping? He says he don't know. That's and he missed. And then he tells you, oh, you woke up from the shot. No, I heard it, and I looked, and I seen a bullet hole right next to my head on the wall, like, Bruh. right there. It was like, like, whoo, so for me, like, I don't know. He says he don't know. I had no reason. We're not together no more. That's why he's my ex, though. <laughs> All right. What's the craziest thing that has ever happened to you? Crazy ex? Oh. <laughs> I do got one of those. And he was, like, stalking me, like, bad for a while. And then he made up, like, this rumor <laughs> in his head that I was fucking with somebody else. And he went banging on the nigga's door. And it was just a crazy situation. That was pretty crazy. Was How do you know he was stalking you? How'd you find out? Because he see he said that he seen my location. And he didn't have my location ever. So how'd he get it? I don't know. <laughs> Ah. <laughs> so he was stalking you, stalking you. Yes, like that for a while. What about you? Um, like way down before, I had this guy go through my phone while I was sleeping and share my location with him. And I didn't know till two weeks after. And then he pressed me about where I was. All these stalkers, huh? <laughs> Heavy. Why do you think guys do that? You're like, why, why do you think they want to know where you're at? I'm that nigga. Um, no. My cousin tried to drown me before. Why? It was when I was younger. I, don't, I mean, she just didn't believe me when I said I couldn't swim. <laughs> and my feet weren't touching the bottom and she thought I was playing and I had blacked out. <laughs> Were you mad at her? Or? I mean, I didn't remember much, so I didn't really, I didn't care really. Whatever. I didn't care. So playing around. It's all winning <laughs> games. My first time ever trying an edible. I <laughs> literally almost died. Wait, yeah, literally. I was um the um supplier. <laughs> and it was her first experience. Wait, Never doing it again. Yeah, but I wasn't Wait, so what happened? Like, yeah, no, I'm were not. you just fucking high as fuck? Yeah. <laughs> I was she too high to function. Down. She couldn't walk. She yeah, no, I down. couldn't function. And this was just off of weed. Weed edible, right? Or like mushroom edible? Yeah. Like, what was it? It was, it was just weed. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, I don't know. Listen, never doing it again. Anything like with marijuana.
Did you enjoy the feeling or was it too strong? It was too strong. I would have enjoyed it if it was less, not as strong as it was, but it was hella strong. I was hearing my fucking heart beat through my fucking brain. I was hearing all types of shit. Room spinning, I was bugging, I was bugging. What's the craziest thing that has ever happened to you? Okay, like in what context, mister? It could be anything. It could be like a near-death experience. It could be like a crazy ex-boyfriend, anything. All right, I got a craziest thing that ever happened to me. Okay, what was it? The time that I was grounded for smoking weed <laughs> Oopsie. And I was grounded, so I lied to my parents and said I was going to a CCD retreat, but instead I went to go stay up at my boyfriend's college house, and they had no idea and they never found out. And it was, I sent my phone up to the religious camp with my other friend, so I had no phone at the time, and I really pulled that shit off. Wait, I, I've gotten caught for smoking weed before, like I left it on the kitchen counter one time. How did you get caught? Like. I stole my dad's weed and he found out. <laughs> Why did you steal your dad's weed? Because I wanted to smoke weed. What could I say? You could have just got your own weed. I was broke. What could I say? I want to smoke his weed. It is what it is. We're fine now. We smoked together. We took a shot of bourbon before I left. Period. <laughs> hey, that's a good father right there. <laughs> good bonding experience. Yeah, now that I'm in college, he doesn't care. But back in high school, he really cared if I smoked weed or not. What's the craziest thing that has ever happened to you? So Selling a, a toy for over a hundred grand. Bro, wait, hold on. You sold a toy yeah. for over a hundred thousand dollars. Look, I'll show you, I'll show you. I'll you can see a picture of it. There's no know. way. I swear to God. No, for real. We, we got a store in Sanford, Connecticut. We sell like all types of drip, chrome hearts, everything, bro. Yeah. Look. A hundred grand. I swear, on my life. What was the reason? What like why it's was it a, valuable? It's four feet tall and there's only a hundred of them that were ever made. And what so what we, is it? What we, toy was it? It's a it's an original fake cause four foot tall statue. We bought it when we were in Tokyo. 118,000 oh, we sold that thing for. Nowhere store. We're in the Stanford Town Center Mall. You gotta come pop out. We got the craziest drip, I'm telling you. Hi, my name is Sofia Maria Consuelos Rodriguez and I am down to party. What's the craziest thing that has ever happened to you? Oh my god, I got it. One time I fell off a skateboard and I broke both my wrists and my ankles. It was an accident. I went airborne. How does that happen? I went airborne. I don't know. I literally. I, I, Did you I, land on all fours? It was the first time I ever tried. Right? I skateboarded. I went <laughs> into the fucking air. Broke both my hands yeah. and my I broke ankles. Both my ankles. How that feel like? Was it really painful? It really hurt, and honestly, only one person saw it happen, and he was really embarrassed for me. So. What's the craziest thing that ever happened to you? You go first. I know this thing. Craziest shit that happened to me, yo. God damn, there's so much crazy shit, yo. All right, so one time, I'm sitting there right with a bad bitch, bro. Badass bitch. She sucking my dick, bro. Crazy ass shit happened. She started deep throwing my shit. I ain't gonna lie, she threw up on my shit, bro. That shit was crazy, bro. I swear I was gonna smack the fuck out of that bitch. Like fully threw up on that shit. Yeah, like hurt on my shit, bro. And I was gonna smack it, you feel me? I ain't wanna do all that, I ain't wanna hit a girl, but she was ashamed and shit. I told that bitch to get the fuck out, kicked out, man. Shit like that, straight up, man. That shit crazy. Was it someone you were like dating or just a random chick you picked up? It was a pickup chick, you feel from me? From where? Girl. Where'd you get it from? I met her at the fucking club, you feel me? Yeah? Yeah, and you brought her back club. to the crib? Yeah, brought her back to the crib. She was getting nasty. It was all good until that shit happened, yo. That shit threw me off, my dick went so soft, but I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> That shit crazy. What's your crazy shit, gang? You never seen somebody get killed or some shit? I ain't seen nobody get killed, man. I almost died in a car accident, though. Shit, I'm still alive, though, you feel me? You still got PTSD for that shit? Yeah, I do got PTSD, I ain't gonna lie. Like, you, drive, you be driving mad slow or what? I be driving slow, I be, bro, I be looking every time. I don't trust nobody on the road, man. I got blindsided, T-bone. Going like 85 miles an hour, bro. Shit, thank God I'm still here, though, but yeah, that shit was crazy. I ain't gonna lie. I see my life, my whole life flash before my eyes, I swear. That shit real, like your whole life flash before your eyes. Like, I see my whole life from beginning to end, birth to that moment. The old cat, can't take this shit for granted, man, you feel me? At any moment, you feel me? Tomorrow, not Palmer, so I just live life one moment at a time, man. Live that shit to the fullest, you feel me? That Zeno, y'all know what's going on. Did you get injured? Yeah, I was in the hospital, I had therapy, I had to do physical therapy, all types of shit, bro. I ain't gonna lie, I was down bad. Yo, I didn't even drive for like five months. I couldn't even drive. I couldn't even get in the driver's seat. I didn't even get in the car too. If I was in the car, I was in the back. Was it their fault or was it? It was their fault. Yeah, it wasn't even my fault. So did you get insurance? Yeah, I gotta get insurance.
shirts. You got I ain't paid all that? Shit, I did get paid. How much you got paid? Shit, they gave me like a good 20 racks. Hey, yo. I should got more for real though, but yeah, I guess somebody can't, can't complain, you feel me? Nah, my boy got like 30 or something. Yeah, her, so yeah, like, her people yeah. getting like 30, 40, but. What'd you use that money on, bro? <laughs> <laughs> whole lot of nothing, whole lot of drugs, whole lot of fucking bitches and <laughs> drinks and ju all, everything you could think of, bro. What's the craziest thing that has ever happened to you? Ooh, I gotta think of that, because there's a lot of things that <laughs> happened to me crazy. There's two different things. So there was a crazy accident, that's some real shit, but for the funny shit, it was definitely some crazy shit. We definitely bring a little train. Wait, you trained somebody? <laughs> Yo, hold on. <laughs> Don't do that. Never again. You heard? Never again. Wait, so you train, train nah, a bitch? Nah, nah, yeah. And <laughs> why why wouldn't you do it again? I don't know, can't front. I'm not with that shit. I like bitches myself. For real, for real. I like bitches myself. Don't do not do that shit. That shit gonna take advantage of bitches. The niggas, like. <laughs> Did you guys just take turns with the same girl or were you like all together just going crazy on her? <laughs> I don't know. Yo, I can't answer that. <laughs> I, can't, I can't answer that. <laughs> I can't answer that. But if you know, you know. You, if you know, you know. It's only for the OG, because it definitely was when I was younger type shit. <laughs> <laughs> what was the other one? Was so look, we had a, we almost had an experience where I had into a bad accident. I got hit by a truck. I swerved out. I hit the railing. Ooh. We almost went flying out the car and everything. I ain't even about to lie to you. It was some real crazy shit. We almost went flying off the highway type shit. Did that like give you like PTSD? Like yeah, it definitely did. It like, definitely did traumatize me. I ain't about to lie to you. When you go, when you go driving and shit, you just be always on the lookout? Out. Yeah, I definitely going slow as fuck now. I ain't about to lie. I be going slow as fuck only when I need to blow. <laughs> Pause. <laughs> What's the craziest thing that has ever happened to you? Our co-worker, um, I fucking hate her, but... She got shot she, in the kneecap. Papa Dio Dios, please forgive me for this, for laughing, but she got shot in her kneecaps. And I feel bad, I feel bad for saying this, but I hope she's okay. I haven't seen her at work. We all work together, but I hope she's okay, though. I just, I just really do hope she's okay, but I don't really like her, so I don't give a fuck. <laughs> but I do give a fuck, because please be safe. Happy Easter, guys. Bye. While I was in Virginia, you know, I had a relationship. We broke up. I was kind of down bad or whatever, you know. I had a little money, you know what I mean. Took my granddad V, cause I didn't have a V down there. I hit some corners, you know, well-known corners type shit. So I seen this girl and then I let her in. She was like, yo, like we gotta go to secluded spot. So you know, it was raining. Lie. She just hopped in the car, random. Oh nah, you already know what it was. They they, they want to block, bro. You already know what time it is. <laughs> they don't, they don't, okay, working. All right, working so you, you know what I'm getting for. You know what the shorty <laughs> is there type shit. So she got in the car and then she was just like, yo, like how much you got? Like what you want? I was like, I'm gonna be real with you. I just want to talk type shit, bro. <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> I've been through some shit, but I just wanted to talk. She started laughing and she got the text I'm like, all right, she probably calling me in the group chat, whatever. So I'm like, yeah, I just want to talk. Man, when I'm in the car, I pulled up, turned it out. Four niggas hopped out. She like, yo, let me, I got to get out and fix my dress. Bro, some niggas trying to be large to the jar or something. Nigga, I speed through type shit, bro. And that bitch still got my $40, nigga. That's the crazy part, bro. But that's probably the crazy shit I can remember. I got more crazier shit, but my ex might see this shit, so I, I got to keep it safe, bro. I ain't going to lie, bro. Oh, I got another one. So I was, I was at my my college dorm, right? And it was some bitch in my room, but I don't like kissing random bitches, so feel me? I text her like, suck my dick. She was like, okay, in the same room, you know what I'm saying? So she started sucking my shit, but before she started sucking my shit, I'm like, don't kiss me, I don't like kissing. She don't kiss me because I don't like kissing bitches, right? I start hitting her shit from the back, she a white girl. So I look at her butthole. Why her butthole mad brown and it's brown shit all over her butthole? And just now thinking about it, this shit about to make me cry, bro. Like, I really, yo, bro, I, I got a video too, my nigga, but her butthole was mad brown. Like, it was brown all over the butthole in the ash cheek. Why is there brown shit on the ash cheek? It's a white bitch. It shouldn't be brown shit on the ash cheeks. That shit shouldn't be real. Oh, While I'm hitting her shit, ha, 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 I'm hitting her shit. My dick got soft. I don't know, but my dick got soft, and I ended up nutting. How'd you nut with your dick soft? I don't know. You ever, like, nut it with your dick soft? That shit happened, right? And I started crying in my bed because I seen the brown butthole. And every time I think about that... <laughs> it's all good, bro. It's all good, man. You do not want to fuck anybody else, bro. I've been celibate for six months because I seen the brown butthole.